hello cancers and welcome back to my channel okay so it is a beautiful day out here in connecticut and i am going to do some quick reads by the water okay i'm keeping it quick only because i know it's a little windy and the sound might be a little bit distorted but i needed to get out the house it's too beautiful to be in the house and just to come by the water get some inspiration here all right so the first card you have coming out here for you um, cancer is shame. Okay, so let's get the guidance for the goddess of shame. And let's see what's going on here. We're going to do a three card spread. <laughs> y'all saw that, right? I just want y'all to, y'all saw that, right? This little bird has been coming over here pretty much all morning. And I, I am obsessed right now. I'm so glad I got that on camera. All right, okay, let's see. <laughs> oh my God, that is so beautiful. All right, so the goddess of shame, okay? It says, you are beautiful and loved. Every part of you and your journey is beautiful, even the ugliest moments. You have a heart, soul, and breath, and that makes you beautiful, okay? So some of you may be feeling some type of way about some things that have happened, or maybe feeling some type of way about some decisions that you've made in the past. But I feel like there's no reason for you to feel any type of way here. I feel like it's time for you to, you know, just put certain things behind you or maybe confront certain things within yourself that you need to confront so that you're not in an energy of feeling like, you know, you have to be in a bubble here. Because the more that you hold things in, the more that they start to eat at you spiritually, mentally, physically. And I feel like for some people, you're holding some things in that need to be let out here. So with the shame card i feel like it's time for you to let those things go or confront those things okay or confront those people or those situations that maybe made you feel some type of way but i'm just freaking out over that bird <laughs> okay y'all see how that bird just came up just came up to me like so close and i feel like okay if that's your energy here it's time for you to get up in their face okay it's time for you to get up in the situation space here if you feel like it's necessary if you feel like there's some things that you still need closure on i feel like those are the things that you should do take some time and get closure here okay i am just too excited over that bird y'all okay <laughs> all right let's see all right yep you got the wheel of fortune in the reverse so yeah there are some things that i feel like you are going against here when it comes down to the cycles that you're in all right so i feel like you do need to go with the flow when it comes down to certain things if you're running into somebody who you may be feeling some type of way about don't run the other way okay i feel like it's it's time for you to confront that situation even if you, you know take your time and do it you know on your own time feel as comfortable as you feel in regards to it but i do feel like it's time for you to do some things here in regards to this cycle here in regards to what it is that you're going through i feel like the more you like i said the more you hold on to situations or the more you just let things just continue to be inside of you it's just gonna you're gonna be feeling the same things it's gonna be the same emotions it's gonna be the same patterns the same luck the same everything i feel like if you want to change this it's time for you to you know turn turn it around turn that energy around here okay turn that energy around and figure out what it is that you want to do you guys the little bird is back so he's on the bench i am just like i'm i'm just freaking out right now all right so yeah. Take some time to change, like change the situation. You wanna change how things work out for you? You wanna change how you feel? It's time for you to maybe confront those situations here. Okay, next we have the Three of Cups, okay? So I feel like if you need some help here, cause I feel like the Three of Cups is, you know, about celebrations, but it's also about, you know, people coming together, people coming together to make this celebration happen. So I feel like if you need some support or if you need someone to be able to be there with you, then I feel like, you know, talk to somebody, make sure there's a mediator there, make sure there's a, you know, if it's a situation where you feel like therapy is needed, make sure, you know, counseling or whatever, get someone who can be in the middle here so that you're able to completely clarify those messages and say what it is that you have to say without coming from a place of um 
anger. I felt like I needed to say that from somebody because I feel like there's a situation that someone's dealing with that they're very angry about and they've been holding this anger in for a minute. Okay, so I feel like first be able to communicate your feelings, be able to communicate those emotions. And like I said, if you need a mediator, if you need someone to be there, if you need a parent or a family member, a brother, sister, whoever, to be in the middle while you're confronting these situations, then so be it. Reach out to somebody who can help you make this situation, you know, a celebrative situation or a situation where it's success, you know? You finally let these things off your chest and then boom, you're able to celebrate, you're able to be happy. You know what I'm saying? So, yes. Get someone who can be in the middle who can help you out here. And if it's very windy, I do apologize. I'm not going to know until I check the video. Okay, yeah. And then you got the Ace of Wands here. All right. So I feel like there's something that's motivating you to make this new start happen. Okay. For some of you, I feel like, um, I don't know. I want to say for some of you, you may find out that you're having children. Or you may find out that something is going on here that's going to make you it's kind of going to force you to to make this thing happen but for some of you i just feel like you want a fresh start here you just want to leave things in the past you want to just move forward so these are the things that's going to ultimately help you to move forward from the past i do feel like this is a good energy here for you cancer and i do feel like it's very supported by god by the universe by the creator by whoever it is you call the higher power okay i feel like these decisions are supported because you've been feeling like it's time for you to confront this you've been feeling like it's time for you to make a change so here's the opportunity for you to do that now and here's the opportunity for you to make something new and different for yourself so go for it okay literally says go for it so go for it okay don't be afraid like i said if you are afraid if you're feeling a little bit anxious get someone who can be in the middle here get someone who can be in the center and who can help you achieve that success the birdie's back you hear All right, Cancer, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. You see the bird? Confront your issues. Confront them and then fly away. <laughs> Take care, you guys.